Finally here at 7, finding all the various constellations in the night sky can be a challenge for stargazing amateurs. Newswatch 16's John Hickey shows us how to star hop in this week's Skywatch 16. Enjoy your night. I'll see you back here at 10 and 11. June is a great month for sky watching newbies. The Big Dipper is nearly directly overhead and you can use it to star hop to other stars and constellations. That's the very first thing people learn how to do is star hop by using the brighter stars. From there, they can find the, the stars in the constellation and make out the patterns. I had an online chat with John Sabia from Keystone College. He's an assistant observer at the Thomas G. Cupolari Observatory. He taught this amateur astronomer how the Big Dipper's pointer stars can be used to find the North Star. The bowl of the Big Dipper, the last two stars, if you look at them and follow a directional line from the left to the right, you should eventually find another star of nice magnitude and that would be the star Polaris, the North Star. And the Big Dipper's handle can be used to find Arcturus and Spica. You just follow the curve of the arc and you'll find the star Arcturus. And that's a brightest orange star. Find Arcturus and you go straight down and you can see a little bit dimmer star, but sort of whitish blue, and that will be Spica in the constellation of Virgo. An even easier way to find various stars is to use our moon as it passes near them. On the evening of Tuesday the 15th, the moon passes directly over Regulus. There is also another star in the area next to the moon. If you look at the moon and at the crescent phase that is illuminated, and just a little bit off to the right, you should see another star. It's not going to be as bright as Regulus. A telescope might serve you well on the evening of Saturday the 19th as the moon passes over Spica. The moon will have just finished an occultation of a different star that will appear just to the moon's right. If the moon occultates something, it means that it covers it up. Is that correct? It covers it up. It passes in front of it. If you're looking for a more detailed look at the night sky, consider meeting up with the Lackawanna Astronomical Society for an observing meeting. We have a link to their website in this story on our website, WNEP.com. With this week's Skywatch 16, John Hickey, Newswatch 16.